Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Ake. So who's he picking out? Ake with the cross. Bernardos! They've scored! Well, it was a hefty deflection, but he's claiming it. So we have our breakthrough. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. João Cancelo has been included in the starting 11 for the first time in some weeks. And it's played forward. just wasn't expecting their midfield to mess up then so when they did they were caught completely cold by such a swift breakaway and such a well worked finish too Leads at the equaliser, and we're all square. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Poveda. And the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Hoists it forward. And we hit half-time. So, a very watchable game so far, action at both ends and the team's level. See so reviews on the first half. Look, this match promised goals and it certainly hasn't let us down. It's been really, really entertaining. It's been a decent 45 minutes. Competitive, certainly, and a goal inch. The second half then, just getting going. So, both teams emerge the same as they were before the break. Sterling on a charge down the left. Phillips tries to get it forward quickly. Chip through. Nicely worked. And he just whacks it away. And it's Bernardo Silva. Phillips plays it forward. Phillips drives it forward. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. And a header! Sunny. And that is that. So nothing between them after all of that. And you can't really argue with the result. Yeah, the manager too unhappy with the outcome. And the fans really well entertained. It's all square in the end. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even. And no complaints.
Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. Well, this really is a great venue. It adds so much character to every game it stages. The action has already started. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Gabriel Jesus. He's always going to be a massive threat, Peter. And that's primarily because his movement off the ball is so effective. Even if he doesn't end up touching the ball, he usually plays a part in his team's attacking plays because... Goes for goal! It's in! What a start! And what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Lovely goal. Perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Liverpool with an early lead. Good start. Defending of the desperate variety. It's come loose. Allen. Gets wrestled off the ball. Phillips did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Right through the middle. It's a... That's a pop! Sticks it away! Ah, oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, there's resilience for you, Peter. As a side, they never lost focus despite the setback, and this is thoroughly merited for me. Now they can go on better, possibly. Strakosha catches it safely. Knocks it away. Klich. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think. He's had a go! No mistake! And the game is well and truly turned on its head! Well, I think there's a few trying to claim offside, but he looks to have been on. Yeah, he was on. Leeds take the lead. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. That's a fine challenge. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. The crowd appreciates good football all round there. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. That's a good ball. Sonny! The first 45 minutes are up. Well, what a comeback. Certainly, I didn't see that coming, nor I think did many in this crowd. So, there was the first half. 
Well, Peter, I'm just thinking of the best way to describe that. Frantic, um, frenzied. It was unmissable and it was irresistible. Forget about the analysis on this one. Just enjoy it. Robertson tries to switch the play. Alexander Arnold. Fine Aldum. Gabriel Jesus. Gabriel Jesus! It's a goal! They have pulled themselves right back into it. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. And they really commit forward the numbers too. It's all very well good. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. This is quite a battle. Well, they're back on level terms, so the guessing game goes on. As to what will happen from here, I've no idea. Alioski. And now they can launch a counter. Sare. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. That's good defending, very good defending. Managed to get it away. Now a chance to break. He's had a shot! Wijnaldum tries to get it forward quickly. And that is that. So it's ended in a draw. Draft and draft and everything apart from a winning goal that never came. An intriguing contest and a result which at least partly satisfies all. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even. No complaints. That's it from us. Many thanks. Go to Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experienced between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to... He's had a shot! Let's go! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Rarely outwitted one-on-one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do. Concentrate on what you have to do.
Leeds take the early advantage. Leeds making the ideal start. It is something to build on. Always when you score early, it gives you such a lift and it, it casts doubt in the minds of your opponents at the same time. And that pretty much sums up the difference in what we've seen. One team assured, the other... He's gone for it! Oh, he did the hard part right, but not the finish. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited and they need filling, and fast. They go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leeds leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1 0 at the break. And it's played forward. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but... Sonny! He scored! And this is getting better and better. Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Leeds get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Click goes long. Rodrigo would try cutting inside here. And he's cut it out. the final whistle. Leeds did it. Terrific team effort to satisfy both the boss and the fans. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, if ever there was a good tone setter for a football match, that was it. First minutes, first shot, first goal, and it set them up. This remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day. Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident, 
the world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is uh, a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. Sade, brought forward. What does he throw from here? Looking to fork Sade! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Hoists it forward. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Real chance! It's in! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Watford take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. And that'll be the final action of the first half. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. Not the most convincing of displays, they could certainly do much better than this. They want to keep things simple, build up their confidence and not rush into mistakes. And that's the end of that, it all started well enough. Sade. And here's Rodrigo. A really good feat. Whistle's gone, that's uh, foul. And this is a great chance to get themselves back square. He'll fancy himself from here. Shapes to shoot! In it goes! And the second half is off to a flyer! I can give the keeper a little sympathy here because I think he might have been slightly unsighted. However, credit where it's due, it's still a fine finish from a tight spot. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, if anyone in this stadium thinks they haven't got value for money, I give up. Tries to get it forward quickly. Sade. And it's Rodrigo. He's away! Leeds have a free kick. Yeah, it would seem a, a little too far out. And this will probably be a uh, think far post. He's gone for the shots. It's anyone's ball. They've played it short. Nice touch. 
That's a good ball. He's gone for it. And in it goes. And the game is well and truly turned on its head. Oh, what a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all round. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Yeah, for me, this team seems to find it easier to attack than defend, but now they're going to need to dig in at the back a bit. Bamford. Decent-looking ball. A chance! Goes for it! Oh, real... And the follow-up! Rodrigo. Great leap! No, he didn't quite meet it right. Sade. Sade! Oh, my word, my word, that is fantastic! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! Two up now, and they are cruising. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now, that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. And that will be the final act. Well, somehow they turned it round. Every ounce of energy, emotional, physical, mental, is spent. That is some win. Well, how will we look back on that? Yes, they turned the lost cause into a great cause. It took resilience and character but they had ample amounts. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.
So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Well, that's where he wants it. Bournemouth on the receiving end of some fairly harsh criticism. Named... And the shot! He scored! First blood drawn. Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things. Just put your foot through it and... That was a good example, great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Leads get themselves into the lead, and that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Shackleton. Sonny! Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Brooks. Stanislas. Now short, tries a shot! What a cracking goal, but a cracking touch as well. That's what made it for me. That's brilliant play all around. <laughs> that has certainly made things interesting. Look, get your seatbelts on. Be there's the end of the first half. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. It's been a really interesting game up to now, and the sides are predictably very well matched. Hoping perhaps for a little bit more from both parties in the second half, but as it stands, it's one each. The second half then, just getting going. No changes at the interval from either side. Sade. That's a decent ball. Shot a goal! It's in! Into the lead once more. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Leads go into the lead. Stanislas, good challenge. He just stood firm. 
Shackleton goes looking. It's broken loose. Shape for an overhead. Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Well, it was certainly an acrobatic effort. I mean, it was probably the best option for him, but they're never easy to pull off. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Tries to get it forward quickly. Got a sight of goal here. Is it in? It's an own goal. Well, that wasn't in the script, and you have to feel for him, Peter. It's ended in uh, some embarrassment. Leads, got some help from Lady Luck there, they all count. And they've been caught out here. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Alioski, Roberts, Sade. Roberts tries to stroke it through, Sade! And there goes the final whistle. Leeds can be very happy with a job well done. An efficient win for which the players simply did enough. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? I enjoyed that, Peter. Both teams went about their work in a, a really committed manner. And for me, it just always held an interest. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.
Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is uh, a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. The Emirates, which has become such a fine landmark, a part of the North London scenery. And a header! Yes! And what a start! A lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met with really this. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Phillips. Driving on, a real charge here. He's in! It's a shoot! Quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Bruno Josao. Bamford. Sade. And the whistle goes for half-time. It's the first half compared with your expectation. Oh, they had their opponents reeling in that half, Peter, and the break may need to change somehow, but don't hold me to it. Leeds are in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. That gets things going for the second half. There's going to be another change here. He's dead. Real chance! And it's there! And surely that settles it. Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Now that's what I call finishing. Right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was there and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Well, no question as to who's winning the battle in midfield at the moment. Some very impressive pressing in place here. Yeah, their position is a, a dominant one now, Peter. So introducing one of the youngsters for some added experience is bang on. Hoist it forward. And now they can launch a counter. Bamford floats one over. And the flag has stayed down. He's had a shot! They've done it! Players ecstatic, fans delirious. This is utopian. A 
looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. the changes then in quick succession well he's worked so hard for a side uh, as you would expect but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to to labor a bit so it's no surprise sorry the dunker gets it back and time is up leads very much the dominant side almost the only side Every time they put on the ball, they look like scoring. It is a landslide. So what do you take away from it, Aldrin? Well, if ever there was a good tone setter for a football match, that was it. First minutes, first shot, first goal, and it set them up. Well, good day to you on a grey day here, which uh, promises rain, but promises way beyond that what should be a really good game of football. The stands are packed here, people have done everything they can to get here. They keep the roads outside were pretty badly clogged, but I think most of the traffic issues have been settled, and indeed I think most people have now got through the turnstiles and are well covered up against the elements, whatever they may throw at us over the next hour or two. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue. Quite a sight to behold. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Hit into the middle. Click. Leeds were imperious when the two sides last met and the fans are asking for more of the same Sonny! And he nearly went all the way Well the run was really impressive, the finish was depressive and expectations were not met Rodrigo Got the ball glued to his feet. The referee's awarded a free kick.
A real opportunity here from a position of great potential. Click, ready to try one. Sonny! There it is! Leeds take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. And we've reached half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. But one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to win with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leeds leading 1-0 at the break. Click. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, they seem intent on marking him out of the game. They're certainly trying to wind them up in the process, Peter. Click. Set up one goal so far. Oh, that's neat. Oh, the and the shot! Oh, taken with style! Two up now, and they are cruising. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. So here comes a substitution. Leeds grab a couple of goals without reply. It's 2 0. Murray. Oh, that's nice. Can he deliver? He's gone for it! He scores! With so little time left, grandstand finish! Oh, whose goal is that? Big deflection. That's one for the dubious goals panel. Changes here from both sides, in fact. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Brighton have to get it into the box and quickly. And that's it. Leeds win it by the odd goal, almost nothing in it, perhaps a draw would have felt fairer, but that's the game, and they have won it at the margin. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, they had a game plan which was about hammering away in central positions, and it paid off. For me, they were persistent and ruthless. Well, that's it from us. Thanks very much, Jim. It's a very good day to you from both of us.